Okay. Hey everyone. Okay. You know what? Today I wanted to talk about mitochondrial DNA. Okay. Because you know how when we were in, when we were in school and high school in biology, how we were taught that we were taught some truth, but not all of the truth, or we were taught little bits and pieces of information here and there and there and not what the heck you put in my hair. No, 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 no. I don't want that. No, no, no. Okay. So we were, we were, we weren't taught the complete truth. So we were taught in biology that we have, we have, we have a total of 46 chromosomes that, you know, everyone should know this. If you're a certain age, if you don't, maybe you just forgot it or you were absent that day in school. Anyways, so we have yeah. Rebecca. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Hold up one second. Yeah. So like I was saying, we were um, taught that we have a, t a total, see Rebecca, we were taught that we have a total of 46 chromosomes in, in, in our body, okay, in our cells. And so we get 23 from my, from my father, and then we get 23 from, from my mother. So 23 and 23 is for a total of 46 from my parents and our chromosome. But one thing that we weren't taught about was the mitochondria DNA. Okay, so that makes a total of 47 chromosomes, not 46. So we actually have 47 chromosomes in each one of our cells. And the 47th chromosome is the mitochondrion DNA. And this mitochondria DNA is actually located outside of the nucleus in the cytoplasm in our cell. So I'm um, one thing about me is I'm a visual learner. So... Um, right now, I'm not in front of a board to draw, so let's just visualize. Okay, here's this cell, right? Here's one of your cells. So us humans, we are made up of over like 50 to 75 trillion cells in each one of our bodies, in each human body, right? So just say, look, so I'm going to just talk about one cell inside of your body. So the one cell that's inside of your body, here's the cell, right? It's kind of like circular, right? So in the middle of our cell is it lies the nucleus. That's where our nucleus, our nucleus is in the middle of each one of our cells. Inside this nucleus is our chromosomes, okay? And like I said, with our chromosomes, we get 23 from our mother, 23 from our father. And inside of the nucleus of where our chromosome is, our DNA is also inside of the middle, the middle of the nucleus, our DNA. And it's actually also protein that's in the middle. This in the middle of the nucleus. It's like half and half, like 50% protein and 50% of our DNA. So, so here's the cell, right? And then so in the middle, in the middle is the nucleus where our chromosome, where our DNA and protein is. Outside of the nucleus, outside of the nucleus is called cytoplasm. Outside of the cytoplasm is where our mitochondria DNA is. Okay, hold up. Let's see. Um, hold up. Okay, so like I was saying, okay, so outside of that is our our mitochondria DNA. So a lot of people, just out of ignorance, just because we weren't taught properly, you all say talk about oh our ancestors, our ancestors back in the day. But just because you all are not as conscious as y'all think y'all are, I'm gonna tell y'all one thing about energy that um. That some people know. And it's like I said, a lot of people have bits and pieces of information. A little bit here that y'all know, a little bit there. But y'all know this, y'all know that, but the dots weren't connected. So once you actually hear something, you're like, oh, okay. That makes, now I understand why I knew this, I knew that. And, you know, the dots is kind of like a puzzle. Not a puzzle, but kind of like, you remember on the paper, like you have that page where you have one, two, three, four, and you connect the dots. Now you're like, okay, you're able to connect the dots and you fully understand reality of life now. So basically what I was saying is, is um, energy. Us humans, we are all energy. We all um, frequencies, we all, everything's made of atoms. So we all energy vibrating on different frequencies. We're energy, you know, E equals MC squared. So you cannot create energy. Energy is not created and you cannot destroy energy. So when, when you, 
when, when a person so-called die and you see a person laying in a casket, you see that with your vision that that person is in a casket, but that person consciousness, that person spirit, which is energy, that person's soul is in a whole nother reality. And that person is not crying over what just happened to them in, in the reality that they were in. They're in a whole nother consciousness, a whole nother reality. Okay. You cannot destroy energy. It only transforms from one form to another. Okay. So what I'm saying Back to the mitochondrial DNA, how people talk about our ancestors, talk about, um, oh, our ancestors back in the day. No, you are literally your ancestors. You are literally your ancestors from back in the day because you cannot destroy energy. It only transforms from one form to another. Okay, you may be 20 years old, you may be 30 years old, logged in into this reality, but where were you before the 20 years? Where were you? Where if you 20 years old right now, where you think you were 21 years ago, you was in a whole nother reality in your past life doing a whole other another thing. You cannot destroy energy. It only can transform from one form to another. Our mitochondria DNA, we are our ancestors, okay? Whether you're whether you're activated or not, you are your mitochond you are your ancestors, okay? Why you think here in the states, here in Babylon, they have so many damn, um, so many damn insulators. Why do you think they chemtrailing us? Okay, because they don't want us to really know who we are. They don't want us to 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 really realize that we are. That they don't want us to wake up. They don't want us to know because they want to continue to be in power and to control us. It ain't about the money. It's about control and it's about power. Okay. You cannot, you cannot, hold up. Okay, like I was saying, um, like I was saying, that's why they have so many distractions here in the States. They have a lot of distractions to keep your mind like, so you don't sit back and realize. And with all the distractions, along with the distractions, they have the insulators. They know about rubber on shoes. These people here in Babylon, could have created some shoes that has carbon bottom so it don't stop the flow of our energy because we're energy it stops the flow of our energy it fucks with it we're not able to you know just like dead animals just call it what it is you're putting something dead in your body is dead animals that's the insulator it stops the flow of your energy and it fucks with your mercury okay you have all these insulators and they have us disconnected from what we truly are so y'all don't realize who y'all truly are okay yeah, once you really know yourself, you will realize that you have the power, but they want y'all to be powerless. They want y'all to not have power. They want, they want to keep y'all in fear so they can continue to control y'all. Okay. When really y'all the ones that have the true power, but because of all the distractions and because of all of the insulators and because y'all want to continue to eat fast foods and continue to drink the soda and continue the true bubble gum and all this stuff. And it may sound silly to some people, but it's the truth. It is, it is the truth. Okay. So that's basically all that I wanted to say, to say about that, you know, because when you eat a genetically modified food and they fucking with y'all food and combining two different things that aren't supposed to be together and they doing the nanotechnology and the nanoparticles that's in the food. Y'all don't really know what, you, what they doing to the food behind the scene and y'all eating that stuff. And not realizing unconsciously that it's messing with y'all mind. The way y'all go with the y'all thinking. Y'all thinking ain't right. Y'all processing. Y'all, hold up. Okay. So that's, that's all, that's all that I wanted to say. No, no, that's all that I wanted to say about that. You know, about our mitochondrial DNA. We don't have 40, we don't have 46 chromosomes. We have 47 chromosomes and we are our ancestors because you cannot destroy energy. Like any, any person, if you sit back and think about it, any person that don't, don't believe me, y'all must do, do, do not, y'all not able to comprehend biology and that mean y'all probably just made f's in biology in high school i don't under i don't know whatever but i am a very objective person and i um you know that's basically it that i wanted to say <laughs> okay bye everyone